you know, slowing down, rubbernecking, only to find no reason for those brake lights on the freeway. There's a name for it. They're called phantom traffic jams, and it's giving drivers everywhere something to be spooked about. ABC 15's Megan Thompson joining us live now for this Operation Safe Roads report in Peoria to explain what that means and the technology hitting the roads to try and stop it. So can you break this down, Megan? Absolutely, Allison, but traffic experts say this has been around since the invention of vehicles. Here's what's new, though, the technology to try and keep you moving forward. Ford has been testing about 30 vehicles for adaptive cruise control on a test track. Just try and see how this may help. Here's how it does, though. There says it keeps the distance between vehicles and the vehicle in front of you, the vehicle behind you, preventing those phantom traffic jams from happening at all. Good morning, America. Riding on the test track just a few days ago, so we decided to ask a local expert if he thought this could be a solution in our state. They see a one vehicle gap or a two vehicle gap, they shoot for it. That's what the adaptive cruise control is going to help with is maintain that gap. Motors could do it too, but it's more driver behavior. Are they willing to do it? We also reached out to ADOT about this technology and if they're doing anything to help with these random backups. They said they were not in a position to discuss it, but Peoria is. And they are taking their own technology beyond the freeway and onto streets just like this one. Coming up in 30 minutes, how they're testing their own technology to try and keep your morning commute much more smooth. For now, reporting live for Operation Safe Roads in Peoria, I'm Megan Thompson.